Let's talk about the musical alphabet. The musical alphabet has seven letters, A through G. There's no more. It doesn't go on after G. So if we were to sing the musical alphabet song, it would sound like this. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. 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 Now I know my musical alphabet. Next time, won't you sing with me? There's no other letters. It just keeps repeating over and over. The musical alphabet helps us know what notes to sing and play. We've also used notes like so and me before to help us know what to sing and play. I am a mom. So when I'm at home, my kids call me mom. I'm also a teacher. So when I'm at school, my students call me Mrs. Parkhurst. I'm also a friend. So when I'm hanging out with my friends having coffee, they call me Carissa, because that's my first name. I go by three different names in three different places, Mom, Miss Parkhurst, and Carissa, but it doesn't change who I am. That's the same with these notes. They can go by So and Me, they can go by Ta or TT, or they can go by their letter names in the musical alphabet. Just a minute ago, you heard the song Bought Me a Cat, and you moved the animal sounds to match with the animal on Quaver. Then you looked at what the rhythms or the notes, melodies, would be for those animals. So it switched from looking like this to looking like this. Well, with the musical alphabet, we can know what notes these are and we could play them. Let's zoom in on the hen. Because we're zoomed in, it's just a little bit blurry, but let's look at those notes. I'm going to tell you the musical names of them. Just B and D. B, D, B, D. Played over and over is the hen's melody. Now, because I know these notes, if I wanted to, I could play them on a xylophone. I'm going to find a B and a D on the xylophone that are really close together. There they are. And anytime I wanted to play the hen's melody on the xylophone, I could by playing B, D, B, D. And then I could play music just like what I heard. Now, lucky for you, on the next page in Canvas, you will have a chance to go play a xylophone on your device. It will look just like this one right beside me. You can have a chance to play around and play any notes you want. And then I invite you to play the hymn's melody. B, D, B, D. When you're done with that, you can come back to Canvas to learn more about the musical alphabet. You are ready to go play some music.